Hi again, everyone. I'm Ken Welch. Welcome to another Leggett test drive. And today I'm at Leggett Mazda of Burlington. And joining me are from the sales and leasing department here, Nick Renovagen. Hello and there. Uh, symphony and opera conductor, internationally acclaimed Boris Brat, proud Hamiltonian. Uh, welcome to both of you. And so today, Boris, you're going to be in the driver's seat. Nick's yes. going to tell us all about this fantastic vehicle. And uh, Boris, if you don't mind, I'm going to do a, a little conducting from the back seat. Yeah, see, at, I, at least I, to I, start. I'm not allowed to conduct and drive <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> That's right. It's one of those things. We'll, we'll let things, you concentrate yes. on that for okay. a while. Okay. So uh, away we go. Starting with a new new car is a bit like you know getting getting acquainted with a new orchestra. So you have to get to know everything and uh, mm -hmm. and uh, actually a lot more dangerous <laughs> in a car than would be with an orchestra. Well, yeah, Nick, I mean, you may as well tell us about yeah, this. Yeah, this, beautiful car. This is this Mazda CX-9. Uh, it's the largest car we sell. It's a seven-seater. And this particular trim is the Signature Series. So when you talk about quietness, luxury, this is the car that offers all of that. What uh, sort of sound system does it This have? has the may Bose stereo system. Oh, Bose yep. is wonderful. We've got uh, 10 or even 12 speakers here. You're sitting on Napa leather. Mm -hmm. Very beautiful, uh, soft textured leather. I can't get over how quiet it is. And, and when we move further down the road, you're going to see just how quiet it is at speed. This particular engine is a turbo, but using regular fuel. Oh, okay. You do not yep. need uh, premium on this car. You oh, have that's about 227 horsepower. And Boris, you're accelerating. You'll probably notice right away there's no lag. Oh, uh, very reactive. People are saying this drives like a car, not yeah, a truck. Yeah, it does. The handling of Mazda, very responsive. Well, Boris, your music career has taken you coast to coast to coast in Canada, uh, all over the world. But something that always brings you home is the Brat Music Festival, season number 32 coming up. Uh, what should we know about it? Well, my goodness, first of all, we have a phenomenal orchestra. Yeah. These are the best of the best of people who have graduated from universities and music schools all over the world who happen to be Canadian. Um, and uh, we auditioned about 250 musicians each year and take 50 so they really are of a very very high caliber and i'm constantly amazed every year for the last 30 years that we've been doing this the quality keeps going up so we start off in burlington actually uh on the 26th of, of uh, june with an all gershwin concert uh, which already is almost sold out uh we have concerts pretty much every week uh, some of the highlights would be we finish the whole series with a, um, a production of My Fair Lady. We do musical comedy as well as opera. We're doing La Boheme this year. Uh, we're staging the opera instead of in Paris, which was the original, of course. Uh, it's being staged in Hamilton in the 1930s, mm -hmm. uh, okay. which was part of the Depression. Very similar to the, the time when uh, starving artists would have been trying to eke out a, eke out a living. Uh, as is the case of, of Bohem. Bohem yeah. is a, uh, an opera that is a, an ensemble opera. That's another thing I was, when I was just reading about your festival. It's, it's kind of multimedia, isn't it? There's a lot of aspects to it. Yes, we do use a lot of, of, of multimedia, particularly for our children's concerts. We are, we are quite famous for our children's concerts. We've had over uh, a quarter of a million young people wow. uh, come to our concerts over the last number of years. We have graduated over 1,650 uh, musicians into the profession and they uh, are in orchestras and and entrepreneurs, musical entrepreneurs as well, uh, all over the world now. Can you shed some light on what the, the Legged Auto Group, what, what their involvement is with you? Well, the Legged Auto Group, Mariella is, is, a, is a wonderfully uh, knowledgeable musician and uh, she has been very helpful in, in uh, having the Legged Auto Group sponsor us and also uh, help us in terms of uh, advertising and public relations. So Boris, you realize you're sitting next to the singing <laughs> salesman of Legged. Yes, in fact, I, he has sung for me before. I know he's a tenor and and I, I heard him sing Dein ist mein ganzes Herz, which is a very famous uh, aria. Yeah. If you're a tenor, it's one of the signature arias. Mm -hmm. Tell us about that connection, Nick. Yeah, co coincidentally here, I'm sitting next to Boris Brat, uh, 24 years ago or so. A uh, very well-known pianist, Valerie Tryon, who works closely with Boris at the festival. Well, world-renowned. World-renowned, I should yeah. say, yes. Oh, well, back almost 24 years ago, her and I did some work together, and she said, well, you should sing for Boris. Mm -hmm. And there we were in Boris's home in Hamilton, um, Singing Dynas my Guns' Herz. Mm -hmm. 
jump forward. I'm selling cars for Mazda and helping people with that. I'm sitting here again. Can we sing with yeah. you, Boris? What do you right, think we, we should end with? Well, there's lots what? of choice in the summer music. Well, what do, so it yes. makes me think of Questo Quella. Lots of choice? Sure. Questo okay. Quella. Per me pani sono a quanta la tre d'intorno. D'intorno mi vedo. Del mio cuore l'impero non c'ero. Meglio ad una. Che ad altre beltà. Bellissima, ah, bellissima, ah, bravo, bravo. Bravo, hai fatto bravo. bene, no? No, lei bravo. ha fatto benissimo. <ride> bravo. Eh, grazie, grazie.